Oshkosh today. Thanks again for joining us on the Christmas special. We've taken a little trip out to the EAA Museum right here in Oshkosh, and we're going to hear about a really fun Christmas event coming up. Uh, I have Caitlin Brewer here, the event coordinator for EAA. And first of all, Caitlin, thanks so much for having us out here today. Thank you guys so much for coming. It's a yes. pleasure to have you uh, see our museum. It's always a pleasure to come. Uh, we love to kind of walk around and take a look at all the awesome exhibits you guys have. Yes. Um, and a really special thing you have coming up is the Christmas in the Air event. So maybe you can give us just a brief overview of what exactly that is. Yes, EAA's Christmas in the Air is Saturday, December 5th. It runs from 10 a.m. until 4 p.m. It's a free community event, so we encourage you to bring the family, come on out. Uh, our museum will be decorated beautifully with uh, Christmas trees and decorations throughout the entire museum. Mm -hmm. We'll also have a variety of groups performing throughout the museum. Um, carolers, jazz bands, uh, dance groups. All kinds of entertainment. Yes. Um, <laughs> it's a great event for kids. Santa mm -hmm. flies in by helicopter at noon on Saturday. Uh, okay. And then you can get in line to sit on his lap and, and ask for any of those special Christmas gifts you'd like. How fun. So really a full event, lots of things to do, impossible to get bored. We'll get into more of um, mm -hmm. the things that we can expect. But first, you know, EAA is really well known for air venture. Um, so why hold an event like this that's kind of more family oriented and um, for the kids? Exactly. Uh, every summer at the end of July, we do host uh, air venture, which brings in half a million people to Oshkosh. Mm -hmm. So this is our way to say thank you to the community for supporting us throughout the entire year, um, not just only during Air Venture, but, but now um, we really appreciate all the support the community offers us. So we want to offer them uh, an opportunity to come and check out the museum. Believe it or not, a lot of locals don't get a chance to come to the museum and see what we have to offer. Mm -hmm. And so it's a great, great opportunity to come out see what the museum has to offer, and bring your family for a really fun-filled day. Mm -hmm. That's a great point. It, it is a great opportunity for people to come out and see mm -hmm. the museum in the first place, and then this whole other fun aspect is added to that. So it's just really a fun all-around event. Yeah, absolutely. So the history of the event, um, how many years about have we been doing this? We have been um, offering Christmas in the Air for over 30 years now. Oh my gosh, so really? It's, it's become a staple. Uh, every year we look forward to it. We have just a great staff that decorates the entire museum and it becomes fun. It gets everybody in the holiday spirit. Mm -hmm. And is there any cost associated with attending the event? No, this is a free family event. We are encouraging non-perishable food items that will benefit the Oshkosh Area Community Pantry. Mm -hmm. um, we also will have a giving tree where we'll have airplane tags that you can take uh, as you're leaving the museum. And on those tags will be the item of a wish list from a, a little boy or girl. And those items will benefit the Oshkosh Boys and Girls Club and the Oshkosh Take Five Club. Oh, how cool. So yes. just bring a, a, a happy heart and an open heart and enjoy your day here. Absolutely. So how, does, how is the event supported? How is something like this possible if uh, it's a free event? We are very grateful to have Oshkosh Corporation back as our presenting sponsor this year. Mm -hmm. um, we also have a variety of different media sponsors, such as Local 5 Live, Oshkosh Community Media Services, and uh, different Cumulus radio stations, as well as Oshkosh Northwestern Media. Wonderful. So lots of great yes. sponsors. Um, are any kinds of funds raised at this event to support other activities at EAA? No, no funds are raised. We simply, um, like I said before, we encourage non-perishable food items to bring in for donation to the Oshkosh Area Community Pantry. Mm -hmm. Other than that, we just bring your family, come on down, see the museum, um, enjoy the activities that we have going on throughout the museum throughout the entire day. Yes, and we got to ask you about the activities. I know you gave us a little bit of an overview. Um, of course, the finale being Santa coming in on a helicopter, yeah. uh, but there's also a lot of other fun entertainment activities and yes. things like that. We are showing movies all day in our Skyscape Theater, a uh, variety of holiday movies. We're also going to be, um, we have an area where children can write letters to Santa that will take pa place throughout the entire museum. Uh, like I said before, we also have different por performance groups performing throughout the entire museum. Uh, Julie's Touch of Silver will be performing their dance routine mm -hmm. in our Eagle Hangar. And that's always a highlight as well. It's a huge highlight. They're <laughs> a great group of, of girls that put on a wonderful show. Mm -hmm. um, and then back again this year are those funny little people, which are <laughs> little elves that put on a very funny dance show for the children and it's, it's a huge hit. Oh my gosh, how fun is that? Any kind of food or um, uh, hors d'oeuvres or anything that we can yes. look forward to? Yes, uh, we do have milk and cookies available. Um, as you're waiting in line to see Santa, we'll have milk and cookies. 
Beautiful. that everybody can enjoy. Oh, you can't complain with that, really. Not at all. <laughs> um, if we're looking to find out more about the event or about EAA in general, where can we go to get more information? You can go to eaa.org slash Christmas in the Air. Wonderful. Um, any more entertainment? I know you said you had some bands and things like that that we can look forward yep. to. A variety of different area um, performance groups, such as the Oshkosh, Suzuki's, um, cellos and violins. Mm -hmm. There's a variety of magical groups from the area, as well as uh, jazz bands and brass ensembles. Awesome. And it's important to ask, um, you know, how is this event important to other programming that's happening at EAA and in Oshkosh? You know, Christmas in the air really for us kicks off the holiday spirit and it's important for us to give back to the community. I think it's a great event to um, showcase in the Oshkosh area. Oshkosh has a wide variety of different holiday activities going on and I, this just adds to the excitement of the holiday season. It's really the kickoff to the whole season and all it the is. fun events here in Oshkosh. Yes, absolutely. So it takes place right here at EAA. Uh, in, is it yep. right behind us, the Eagle Hangar, that will oh, actually it's, back there that's going to be taking place? Yep, it's throughout our entire museum. Awesome. So the whole museum will be alive with holiday cheer yes. and everything. Yeah. Um, and then once again, maybe if you want to give us the, the date, time, and uh, where we can find more information. Sure. It's Saturday, December 5th, and it runs from 10 a.m. until 4 p.m. You can go to eaa.org slash Christmas in the Air. Wonderful. And you are very active on social media as well, so yes. you can follow EAA. Find on us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Awesome. Wonderful. So we got to make sure we're taking pictures and hashtag Christmas in the Air. Yes. Hashtag EAA and everything. Yeah, so. absolutely. Wonderful. Well, we're really looking forward to it, Caitlin, and thanks again so much for having us out here today. Thank you for coming. Oshkosh Today your connection to events and organizations in the Oshkosh area. Oshkosh Today is supported in part by the Friends of OCM. Aurora Healthcare, 855 Northwest Haven Drive. And House of Flowers, 1920 Algoma Boulevard.